Hello everybody, this is Dreaming Gamer back for another Dinosaur King mini tournament. Yes, it is about time I have done one. I think this is the first one we've done this year, which, and we're in September, so that's mental. I put a poll up, and by popular demand, this was the winner. And we will reveal it now. So yes, you guys wanted the trike tussle, and the winner will receive this smexy golden triceratops. Oh, you guys have no idea what you're in for. Right, so I will go through the combatants. We're going to do the uh, matchups as well. Right, so here are our combatants. It will, there will be 16 different variations of the Triceratops. And uh, yes, here's the vote. It's won quite unanimously, actually. So we have five grey Triceratopses. We have two orange Triceratopses. We have two Chomps, two Maximuses. One Maximus with Spectral Armor, one Dinotector Chomp, one Triceratops Dinotector, one Super Triceratops, and one Super Chomp. Uh, now, for these two, the Awaker Mode will be activated when their HP is below half. As for the Dinotectors and the Spectral Armor, it'll be the same as normal. They'll be activated when they uh, first chance I get. And here is our beautiful setup. So I tried to pick uh, various moves try to pick some to like accommodate the strength of each triceratops so yeah this is going to be very interesting so place a comment down below which triceratops do you think is going to win right without further ado it is time to have a look at the matchups for the first round because i haven't actually done them yet because i am doing it slightly different so we are randomly generating them online instead of me going through like a random number generator it's much more quick and efficient so we have our lists of triceratopses and chomps and maximuses and let's see who will play who in round one. Okie dokie. So our first matchup will be the orange Triceratops taking on Super Chomp, which will be in this video. Then it will be Super Triceratops taking on Chomp. Oh, wow. Both Super Dinosaurs on this side. Um, up third, we will see a grey Triceratops taking on Maximus. And then it will be a grey Triceratops taking on the orange Triceratops. <laughs> and they're both paper paper type okay so all the armors on this side of the draw so we got chomp dinotector taking on the gray triceratops then we have maximus with a spectral armor going up against chomp that'd be a good matchup and then we have triceratops taking on maximus and down here we have got triceratops dinotector taking on the gray triceratops take a drink every time i say triceratops in this tournament without further ado let's get on with our first matchup shall we and yes, it'll be a best of three like it normally is for 1v1s. Let's get it on. Right, this ought to be fun. <laughs> In the red corner, we have got the orange Triceratops. He is strength type. And, uh, well, kind of a basic move set to be honest. Not, nothing too spectacular. Standard run of the mill for a gold ray. No flash. Right, in the blue corner. We have got Super Chomp. And um, like I said in the intro, Await the Mode will be activated when his HP blow up. And yes, you're going to be seeing a lot of maps in this tournament. <laughs> hey, you guys voted for it. You got what you wanted. Oh, this is going to be so exciting. <laughs> this is going to be like the silliest tournament ever. Right, that's a four. So, yeah, moves will be randomly generated by what? Okay, that's a good start there from Chomp in the first hit. Okay, that's a tie. Scissors is the magic num is the magic crit, because all these Triceratopses have scissors crits. And there's a crit from Chomp. Good shot. The uh, other Triceratops really struggling at them. Okay, there's a hit though, and that's a crit of his own. That's going to trigger the Thunder Driver as well. Okay, that's not below half yet, that's slightly above half. Okay, there's a hit from Chomp. Struthio Rush coming in. Oh, but the Orange Triceratops hangs on. Oh, hang on. Is this a Lightning Axe? Yes, it is a Lightning Axe. That is going to be lethal for Chomp. And Chomp, Super Chomp, is going to go 1-0 up. A well-timed Lightning Axe there from Super Chomp. 
We didn't see the awaiter mode though, which is kind of a shame. Okay, we start with a tie. I think Chomp does have the plasma anchor. So that is something that is a that is a factor during ties, but that's a big crit from the orange trike. Still just above half, so no awaker mode yet, but that does trigger the Thunder Driver. Okay, now we could see awaker mode here if Chomp can survive. Oh, and he does better than that, he gets a crit. Good response from Chomp, can he, can he take the 2-0 victory? One awakened hit from Chomp will end this match. Could be all on this. Oh, that's a tie. Chomp does have the plasma anchor, I think. Oh, that tie might do it. Oh, I've almost done it. Can the orange triceratops survive? No, he can't. That crit's gonna do it. And Ch Super Chomp is gonna advance to the quarterfinals, the top eight at the expense of the Orange Triceratops. Taking the 2-0 victory there, Chomp, Super Chomp. Well done. Right then, on to our next matchup now, which should be a um, another trike classic. Right then, in the red corner, we have got the Super Triceratops. So same uh, conditions for, for this one as it, as, our, as it was for Super Chomp. Wait the mode when his HP blow half. But unlike Super Chomp, this Super Triceratops does have a hard hitting crit with a kamikaze tackle. So Chomp is gonna have to be careful here. Right, in the blue corner, we have got Chomp. He's Super Crisis type. And the moveset does accommodate that, so. Don't be surprised if this guy gets some come from behind wins in this tournament. That final fury. Gonna wreak ha could wreak havoc. Okay, that's a tie. Uh, no plasma anchors this time, so ties will be as you were. Oh, it's Chomp getting the first hit. Not much damage done though. Okay, the orange Triceratops responds with his first shot of the match. A Tappy Jara dive to come as well. Good hit. Oh, as a kamikaze tackle, this could be lethal for Chomp. The orange tri the uh, Super Triceratops does hit pretty hard. And yeah, there it is. Down goes Chomp, just like that. It is 1-0 to the Super Triceratops. The Super Triceratops really tanked like a boss. And yes, we got Max back. Okay, that's a tie, but again, that didn't really suit anybody. Okay, there's a hit, but Orange Triceratops, the Super Trike gets the first shot of the match. Tappy Jara died to come. Not ideal for Chomp. Okay, can Chomp land the crit here? Oh, he can! And it's a Thunder Bazooka! This crit's gonna do some damage. Good response from Chomp. Really landing his first big shot, but it is awakening time for the Super Trike. Can Chomp survive this? Or will the Super Trike take a 2-0 victory? Okay, that's a tie. It's not ideal. Oh, that's gonna do it! That is gonna do it! That's Chomp out of the tournament. Well, one of the Chomp type, anyway. And it is the Super Triceratops going through with a 2-0 victory. And well, last eight round will be interesting. It'll be Super Trike going up against Super Chomp. Okie dokie, let's move on to our third match. Okie dokie, in the red corner, we have got our first Grey Triceratops of this tournament. And it's the Tie type version, so he, he is the OG Triceratops in Dinosaur King. If you ever couldn't use a dinosaur, this was the one you used. 
the defaultest of the defaultest. Right, in the blue corner though, we have got Maximus. We got the poison type one here. Um, not much to say to be honest. Uh, could it win a tournament like Armatus did? If you remember, like eons ago, Armatus did win the Earth tournament. So can Maximus follow it his their compatriots' footsteps? Tight. Okay, that does trigger the Gatlin spark of the uh, Grey Triceratops. And the Grey Trike is tie type, so ties do help it out more. And well, we're getting ties so far. Nothing to separate these two. Okay, that's a crit though. That's a big crit. A Thunder Bazooka coming from Maximus. Okay, this is going to do some big damage to the trike. Yeah, look at that. Massive hit. And yeah, there it is. Two Thunder Bazookas. And that is a 1-0 lead for Maximus. And the Triceratops just, just couldn't get that Gatling Spark off, could they? But it's not over for him yet. Okay, there's a hit. Didn't get one of those last time. And I forgot what it is. It's a stomping hammer. Boosh. Okay. Ooh, there's a tie. That triggers the Gatling Spark. Can the Triceratops get that Gatling Spark off and level things up? Oh, he can't. And instead is another Thunder Bazooka from the Maximus. These things do big damage to each other, especially when they get off crits. Oh, and that's a poison as well. That's not good. That's really not good. Maximus on the brink of the 2-0 victory. Okay, it's a tie, but again, that poison's really going to wear the Triceratops down. That's another tie. He's going to just survive, I think. The tie type really keeping him alive. Not gonna survive that one though, and Maximus takes a 2 0 victory. Wow, and they've all been 2 0 victories so far in this tournament. But yeah, that's Maximus going through to the last eight, and our OG boy Triceratops bowing out. But not to worry, there's, uh, there's a few more OG trikes that could do well. Right then, on to our final match of this session, no? Huh? Well, this could be an interesting one. Right, in the red corner, we have got a Grey Triceratops. And it is the Paper Paper type version this time, so it's uh, the latest version, as they say. I think the Catching Food era Triceratops. <laughs> we'll see how he fares. But, in the blue corner, we have got the Orange Triceratops, who is also Paper Paper type. Although this card was this guy was never printed. You know, we only got to see Super Trike and the Dino Tector version of this guy, but we never got like the OG one. Kind of a shame really. I mean it should have been it should have been released, let's be honest. Okay, Grey Triceratops getting the first shot. Wow, that was not much damage. Okay, does trigger the Thunder Driver though. The well timed Thunder Driver could prove the difference between winning and losing. Oh, that's not good though. The orange tried getting the crit on the board. Okay, the paper paper effect is being triggered here. A big hit here from the Grey Triceratops could swing this match his way. And he gets the hit. A crit block coming as well. That's going to increase the likelihood of the plasma anchor there. There's the extra bit of damage. That was a good shot there. The crit might have ended this match. And now, as per the shockwave rules, the Grey Triceratops will be going for patient. Okay, gets a tie. No plasma anchor though. Oh, but it's a crit for the orange trike. Is that the dig deep? What we got here is an electric charge as well. Well, the orange trike has the lead, but a hit here from the grey trike, and he can take take this victory. Oh, and he doesn't! 
Instead, it's going to be a lightning strike coming from the orange trike, and they take the lead. And they will be going 1 0 up. Right, the ho then, on to round two. Oh, that's not good. That's a crit right off the bat from the orange trike. Okay, no electric charge though, but that crit did do some damage. Oh, that's another hit. I think that's a neck crusher coming from that Triceratops. And things really not looking good for the grey trike. Come on, Othello, you can do it. Okay, that's a tie. Okay, we do see a Plasma Anchor. Plasma Anchor is a factor in this matchup. A good shot here from the Grey Triceratops. Plasma Anchor lowering the opponent's defense. That'll make the Orange Strike more vulnerable to damage. Can it come back from this? Nope! Nope! No comeback! And it's yet another 2 0 victory in, the, in this video. This time to the orange Triceratops. And well, unfortunately, another grey Triceratops bites the dust. Well, that was uh, fun, wasn't it? Right, we'll have a look at our brackets and we will end the session. Right, I've sorted out the brackets. So for our last eight round, it will be, well, two of our matches are confirmed. Will it be Super Chomp going up against Super Tri? That's going to be really fun. Maximus going up against the Paper Paper type Orange Triceratops. So stay tuned for the next part where we will have all these matches down here and we will find out our last eight. So until then, ta-ta.